likes drinking beer? We do. Who likes drinking beer? We do. We do. Who likes drinking beer? We do. We do. Right, today we're going to try out Fallen Acorn Double Tide. It's a 5.0 modern lager. Not an old lager, no, this one's a modern lager. Before we go ahead, do that whole subscribe thing. That would be ace, because we like the love and we'll give it back. Do a like on the video, because that's real nice. It shows us that you like stuff. And then the little notification thing to let yourselves know when we do a new beer review. I say we, sounds like I'm a little bit schizophrenic, but actually, I'm talking about all of us because you and me were in this together. Anyway, without further ado, let's crack on with Double Tide from For an Acorn. So, let's give it a little pausey in the old glassy. Gluggity glug. I can hear some fizzle. I can hear some fizzle, but not too much. So, there it is. Look at that. Look at the colour of that. That's beautiful. You can see through it. You can see through it. Look. But it is a nice, nice sort of uh, yellowy, sort of golden colour. Let's have a little sniffy, snifty. <sighs> so yeah, malt's coming through straight away. Let's give it a little shake, a little shake. That's the intensive sniff. Okay, with the intensive sniff, I'm getting a little sort of citrusy vibe about it. Not overpowering, not too much. It's still more malty than it is citrusy but there is definitely a tang coming through on the aroma let's have a, let's have a little taste mm. so there's a real tang about that it's a real immediate tang I'm trying to think what that reminds me of i'm gonna have to go again It's not dissimilar to a um, to a bit of a cider tang, to be honest. There's a sweetness, there's a bitterness down the side of the tongue, that kind of like bitterness, which we like. Top of the tongue, a little bit sweeter. The on the exhale, really, it gives you that real lager vibe, which I quite like. We like a lager. It's light certainly not heavy and, and and the carbonation is not heavy when it goes down it doesn't feel like it's sort of fizzling up gonna bloat you up a lot it's um it's calm it's a calm carbonation i like a calm carbonation mm. yeah an ongoing it's a refreshing taste it's a refreshing light bitterness down the side sweetness on the top it's a really really nice balance between the two and at 5% as well, you know, it's, it's sort of your standard slightly higher strength um, lager that you might buy elsewhere. But this is richer, there's a definite, there's, I mean there's more taste to this than some of the supermarket lagers you might pick up. Mm. A lot more depth of character, a lot more roundedness on the tongue, a lot more satisfying. Oh, lovely. Might just have a little look at the can, see what that says to us. So it says, lager gets a bad rep. Mostly thanks to macro breweries churning out bland fizzy water that hasn't touched a hop in its life. But we don't think that does the style justice. Our in-house yeast results in subtly fruity flavors, getting that. Uh, clean, crisp lager notes, definitely clean and crisp. Sweetness combined with spicy Czech hop character for an extra depth of flavor. That's what I'm tasting, it's that Czech style sort of vibe to it yeah it has got that but it's not as it's not as in your face as there you know full-on Czech lager um, there is a unique double tide here in the Solent that's true um, this is here to rip it up as hard as the waves do go on fallen acorn get in there I love these guys right up so anyway this is a lager, it is double tied, so if you're into a lager, you need to try this one because it is 
fuller in flavour, it is fuller in body, everything about this lager is a ton better than you're going to get down your local supermarket. Come on down, we have this constantly in the Craft and Local Beer Shop in Limington because it's so flipping awesome. 5% from Fallen Acorn Brewing, give this little fella a bash.